Expectations, the assumption of a presumption of a predicted hope. From the minute of our conception, our parents had a perception of who we would be. Whether it be boy or girl, we were told that we were meant to change the world, that we were superheroes and princesses, nothing short of perfection. From the first time that someone special looked us in the eyes and fed us all those lies of who we are supposed to be, only to realize that it was nothing more than a deception. Yet we still try, and we try to make it all work out and be the best we can be. Yet we still sometimes fail. Then comes the stress and the anxiety of not being able to live up to what we are expected to be. And we look in the mirror and see that we're not even close to who we are supposed to be. You are no longer abandoned. No longer do you just blow away with the wind. No longer do you have to do this alone. Because every day when we wake up, we wake up in a world filled with hate and brokenness. Every day when we wake up, we have to put on a show so that everyone believes we are fine. When in reality, we are dying inside. When in reality, we are craving affection. Don't you see? Jesus Christ is the one who can set you free. You're loved. Jesus loves you for you. And you do not have to be anything or anyone that you are not. You are perfectly made just the way you are. So put on your cataracts, kid, because you are truly lacking the vision to see that the love you seek is just Jesus saying, come to me. From this day forward, I refuse to be defined by others. I choose to live for the applause of an audience of one, the one whose blood which I am covered. I refuse to follow the crowd and listen to the doubters and naysayers. Instead, I will listen to the sound of my Savior. I refuse to have a people-pleasing, envious heart, but rather I will choose to love. This one thing remains, and as I fall deeper into your love, I realize it is okay to fail. We sing the song where feet may fail, but God, even if my feet fail, at least I'll sink in your ocean of grace. God has a plan and a purpose and a destiny for you, free of expectations. God judges persons differently than humans do.